Here's the proper workflow of designing a complex part from many individual files. The idea is that you start with a blank document here, <clears throat> a file merge. The idea is to build a complex project from many files. So we're doing the electrical enclosure, the electrical panel for the CD co home here. So we're going to start with a closet. It's just a it's a big box where everything goes into it. View is perspective view. Okay, so there it is. There's our closet. This is actually six feet tall. This is where we're going to put all our components. So in the tree view, rename this to electrical closet. So basically we're importing a bunch of files. Not importing, but merging then in the tree view you have to label everything so everything is transparent. First is the electrical closet. We know we have more parts. Merge. Breaker box. We have a breaker box. And these, these are all lining up at the origin here, but just putting them into this. These are all the components inside the electrical closet. Rename. That's the breaker box. And I'm keeping track of the ones I uploaded, actually used already. Uh, getting rid of them. So I keep my workspace clean. Okay, next. Merge. Let's put an inverter. That's going to sit down there. That's our inverter that we put in. label it. Depending on how these were generated, different shapes might come here. If this is a primitive, this is, could be a fusion, uh, so things like that. Okay, let's add some batteries in there. Battery is just a black box. Rename that. Battery. This one hasn't been simplified Actually, it is. It's just the battery. Nothing in there. That's the battery. Next. And do the charge controller. Next, do some electrical boxes. Deep box with switch. So it's just uh, an electrical box. And what happened here? So these three apparently are the deep box with switch. And that's uh, it's a little mess messy here. So what I want to do is probably get rid of that. It makes it complicated in the tree view. So I'm going to go back into the deep box. Uh, open it up. Um, sorry, that was not that one. That's a simulated deep box with switch here. Well, we want to unionize that into this fusion. If I copy that, Select objects with a dependency on an unselected object. Do you want to copy them to? No. No. Make a new page. Paste in here. Where is it? It's here. Sometimes things don't appear. But that's our deep box with switch. So now. I'm going to save this deep box with switch. I'm actually going to put that into my part library here. This deep box here with switch here, I'm going to upload this new version. Whereas this one was 7K, this one is going to be 5K. Not a big difference, but uh, just smaller and neater. I'm going to note here 
unionized sounds political so reduced in memory upload that so now we have this this better file I'm gonna get rid of this deep box with switch here and use that one so go back to my file close off I go back to now how do I switch between these okay close that without saving okay this is where I'm dumping everything in into here so let's let's now merge the box with switch so label it here. All right, and then continue. So here, continue merging. File, merge. Just have a deep box here. So label that. Uh, rename, rename that deep box. And then merge the last piece. There's some more pieces, but this is enough for now. Shallow box, so that's shallow box, shallow electrical box. And now we have it. So now we can move these things around. We can we can uh, point to these ones. So go into you now go into draft, draft workbench, which allows us to move move things. So say take the inverter, take my inverter, move it, now let's see. Get rid of the closet here. So that's our inverter. So we want to basically design this whole thing by putting everything into the closet in an organized fashion. Um, yeah, so you see how we're starting to move things around and uh, pr probably copy the battery, make multiple copies of that. So since we have eight batteries total, let's do that. Let's make my batteries. You select copy it's going to copy this thing so let's copy more batteries we got three four so you get the idea if you close the electrical closet so yeah now we're arranging all our batteries in there and so forth so this is the process of building up this whole electrical panel in full cat and that's it